I got my candy key package. Last week I did exposed uh, first impression slash wear test. I will link the video down below if you are into exposed that shade. But now I got my candy cane. Let's open it up. You know that candy cane is always out of stock, right? The candy cane is the most popular shade. So the first time I ordered it, it's out of stock. So I purchased it, um, I guess, a few few days later but now it's out of stock again so here it is same as always what is it this card the Kylie's note and let's see the bill so I don't think anybody has mentioned how expensive that is to for you to get it not the single kit. Single kit is 29 US dollars. That doesn't sound that much with the lipstick and the lip liner, right? The whole kit is not expensive, but the shipping is almost $9. So $8.95. I guess if you purchase more than one kit, that kind of in some way save you money. But again, you buy more product and the tax is 218 so altogether it's like more than ten dollars already so plus the 29 one single kit I paid 40 13 US dollars 40 doesn't sound that cheap anymore right that's how you got it the first time I purchased it um, the exposed lip kit is available but the candy cane not available so I only purchased the lip liner but then the candy case is in stock, I don't want any other shades, so this is the only one I purchased. Let's try this! I mean, the product is really good. From the last time I did the review, it's really good. And really pigmented and lasts a long time. Shade really gorgeous and not dry your lips. All the good things, but I don't think it's a cheap product. Even somebody said, oh, 29, that's so bad. You didn't eye it up, right? Okay, let's try this. So again, this is the lip liner, short. This is the lipstick, really nice. I will zoom you in. Okay, first lip liner, okay. Again, I will fill them in so that will last longer. Test it. Definitely last longer. Okay. Very good shade. See the shade and my inner lip? It's almost the same color. That's what you want. So you won't have the wet line inside after a while. And also when it fades, it's almost, you can see your true color and it matches the lip color. So it doesn't seem that bad. So if it is lighter, much lighter than your inner lip color, then it's very noticeable and it seems like a concealer, that kind of a fact. That's the fact I don't want. So this is a great shade. Definitely a deeper nude, not a everyday kind of a light nude. This is like more elegant nude. No wonder this is Kylie's favorite and everybody's favorite since it's out of stock all the time. Okay, so this is the lip liner. Let's try the lipstick. have the same smell oh yes I want to eat it it smells so good okay oh the lipsticks is lighter 
than the lip liner. Really complement each other. See? The lipstick is lighter than the lip liner. See? Like it! Very good! I think it's the same formula and the feel to it as the exposed. So that's a good thing. So I guess all the colors kind of uh, have a similar finish and uh, the feel to it. It's not dry, not sticky, very comfortable. I don't even feel like I have a lipstick on. And it's good! So from far away, still good, right? Okay, um, so same as exposed, I will take maybe take a few photos during the day and then and at the end of the day, if I have something more to tell you guys, I will hop on and do some kind of uh, final check-in. If not, then that's it. If you want a deeper review, then check out the exposed. I will leave the link down below so you can check it out. All right, uh, I have to go to work. Ooh kind of late. So I have to go to work now, so I'll see you in my next video. Okay, let's touch up. After lunch, touch up. <laughs>